One of the things that a lot of guys who are in business will say, oh, it's so hard to find good staff, so hard to find good employees. And then you ask them, well, why is that? It's because, well, they no one wants to work hard. No one's any good at their jobs anymore. No one wants to put in. They just care about themselves. And so then the immediate question I'll ask back is, well, how much do you invest in your employees? How much do you invest in training them? How much do you give? How much do you care about them and their futures? How much do you care about the house that they want to buy? How much do you care about the effect that work has on their family and what you're actually doing, what you're providing there? Are they spending enough time here? Are they spending enough and not enough time? Are they in alignment with their summit? How much time do you spend there? And one of the most common answers is zero, right? And so that's a big area of incongruence where you as the business owner, or we as the business owners, we are expecting our employees to care about our business as much as what we do, but we don't care about the employee's life as much as what they do. And so if you want somebody to be highly invested in your business, care about them, show congruence there, right? If you expect somebody to treat you a certain way, start by treating them that way and start by acting that way in return, because it's amazing how well people will perform when you actually give a shit about them. And I think that's one of the biggest issues that we have in general. And so I feel that congruence is one of the areas which costs millions of men money and happiness, because when we act incongruently, we often lose what we want to get. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you got something out of it and you want to learn more, click the link below or type in High Performance Conversations with James Can, and you'll be able to check out all the podcasts that we've done. We cover a stack of different topics, everything from getting your mojo back, overcoming anxiety, self-doubt, self-esteem, and learning from some of the industries and some of the world's top performers in both business and in health. Look forward to having you on there. 